OK, you want to add a watermark in Microsoft Excel. We're going to cover inserting a text watermark and a picture watermark. Let's start off with a text watermark. Now, you will need to change your view to do this. By default, you'll be in the normal view. You can see this on the View tab. But I'm going to change the view to Page Layout View. Now, the reason I'm doing that is it shows the header at the top of the sheet. And I'm going to click in the middle part of the header. And here I'm going to type my watermark text. I then need to format it. So I'm going to select the text. And you can use this toolbar, if you see it, to format your text. Or you can go to the Home tab on your ribbon and use the font options. So you could change the font that you're using. You can change the font size. I'm going to type in 130. You can change the color. Now, the color wants to be quite light because it is a watermark. OK, so the next thing to do is think about the placement of the watermark on the page. At the moment, it's near the top. But if you click before the watermark text and just use Enter on your keyboard, you can bring it down the page. So you just need to play around with the placement there. But once you're happy, just click outside the header and you can see how it's placed on the page. Now, you will see the watermark in this view. And remember, we're in the page layout view. But if you go to the normal view, it won't show the watermark. That's just how Excel works. You will also see it if you do a print preview. You can see it there. OK, let's see how to add a picture watermark. So I'm in the same view, page layout. Remember, you're going to find that on the view tab. I'm going to click into the header as I did before. And then I'm going to go to the header and footer tab on the ribbon. And you'll see an option here for picture. So if you click on that button, you then need to browse for the picture that you want to show as a watermark. Select it and click on insert. Now it won't show the picture as a watermark initially. It just shows ampersand picture in the header area. What you want to do is click in front of the ampersand. And just like we did with the text, we want to bring it down the page a little bit. So you need to experiment with this. But then once you've done that, just click outside the header and you should see your watermark image in the background of your worksheet. Now, this is obviously too bold. So we need to click back into the header, go back to your header and footer tab, and then click on this button, Format Picture. Now, if I wanted to change the size, I could just use this scale option here. So let's say we want it 80% of the current size. To make the watermark less bold behind the sheet, go to your Picture tab. And in this Color menu, choose Washout, and then just click on OK.